What's going on guys? Got an electric GE range and the light is stuck on and all the switches are off. And all the burners, they're cold. So obviously that light is for these burners and that light is for these burners. So I'm going to pull the back off here and figure out which switch is causing the light to stay on. So we got the stove pulled out, got it unplugged, and now we're just going to take these couple screws out right here, pull this top cover off. Alright, so now we got the cover off, and if you look on the back here, here right there is the light. Right there, you come around. That's that, so you want to see the wires that connect to it, which is the yellow off this switch, comes into the light, and then the yellow comes back out of it, goes to that switch. So to find out what switch is causing the light to stay on when it's plugged in, um, let's see here. See the light's on. So we'll unplug it. Try this one here first. You want to make sure this wire isn't touching anything. I'm just going to tuck it in between these wires here so it doesn't touch any metal. Plug the stove back in. Light's still on. So and as you can see, it's glowing, so it's going to be that one there. So we'll plug this switch back in. You can put a piece of tape over it or as long as it isn't touching any metal I'm just tucking it in between here so it doesn't touch anything all right so we unplugged it from the first switch here we'll see if our lights out now and it is so that's our bad switch right there So we'll run to the shop and grab one of those. Okay, got our new switch. It's a WB24T10025, and that's for the 8 inch burner. Alright, so you just want to pull your knob off and remove the two Phillips screws here. Okay, pull the switch out the back. Okay, got the new switch out of the bag. There it is. So now we'll just take these wires off, go wire for wire, and hook them on the back of your new switch. Finish the wires. Yep. 
black, red, and blue. So black was on the end. Red in the middle. And the blue on the end. It's all wired up. Now uh, we'll put our knob back on. Plug it in, see if the light stays off. No light. That's it. Replacing the switch on a GE electric range for the 8 inch burner so if you have your light stuck on while your switches are off find out what switch it is just look uh, where your light is here just follow the wires out and just pull one off each switch plug it back in see if the light goes out and when it does you know what switch is bad alright thanks for watching see you on the next one